Let's get started. Today, guys, we are going to build a tiny house. It will be our little secret. I've always wanted to have a very, very small house for myself. Whoa, JJ, what was that? Are you, are you tiny? All right. Yup, Mikey, I am. Isn't it crazy? I found this magic potion that made me tiny. Now I can build mini houses. Oh my gosh, that's, wow. Holly Molly, I want to be tiny too and join in on the fun. Can I? Are you kidding me? Of course. The more the merrier. Just be careful with the potion, okay? You only need a drop. <laughs> Let's do it. This is going to be epic. Wait, JJ, how do I become tiny like you? I mean, whoa, I've never seen anything like this before. Oh, don't you worry, Mikey. I've got a way to make it happen. All right. No way. What is it? Are you going to use some kind of crazy magic? Haha. <laughs> well, it's a little secret for now. Whoa, JJ, is that me? Look at my tiny hands and my feet. Oh, my gosh. Haha, <laughs> welcome to the tiny club. All right, now you see what it's like down here. This is crazy. I never imagined I'd actually become this small. Wow, everything looks so gigantic from down here. Well, now that you're one of us, let's get started on building our homes. Let the best architect win. Oh, you're on. My house is going to be the cutest, tiniest masterpiece this side of the server. Are you kidding me? I've been tiny for like five minutes longer than you. Trust me, my house will be the stuff of legends. What was that? Just because you've been tiny a tad bit longer doesn't make you the master builder here. Oops, maybe I'll even add a mini garden. A garden? Oh, Mikey, I was thinking more along the lines of a tiny castle with a moat. Bam, beat that. A castle? No way. That's a little ambitious, don't you think? And here I was, thinking of a charming little cottage with flowers and everything. But, hey, go big or go tiny, I guess. Exactly. Go big or go home. Or in our case, go tiny or go home. Ha ha. But hey, maybe I'll add a dragon to my castle, just for fun. A dragon? Really, JJ? Now you're just showing off. Just trying to keep things interesting. But seriously, your idea sounds lovely. Maybe I can borrow some of your design elements? We'll see about that, Mikey. Challenge accepted. Ugh, this is harder than I thought. Everything is so fiddly when you're this size. No way! What was I thinking? Look at this mess. I can't get anything right. Oops, looks like someone built a unique masterpiece there. Ha 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 ha! But hey, don't worry. It's your first tiny house. It doesn't have to be perfect. Oh my gosh, JJ. I can't believe this. Look at how awesome our tiny house is turning out. No way I could have done this without you. Whoa, easy there. All I did was give a few suggestions. Most of this was you. All right, maybe the pointy roof was my idea, but you nailed the color scheme. Are you kidding me? Your touch with the windows and the door? Pure genius. And that little garden patch? Holly Molly, it's adorable! Well, a home isn't a home without a garden, especially for tiny folks like us. Ha ha! But seriously, Mikey, you have such a great eye for design. You just needed a little confidence boost. Wow, thanks, JJ. I was really feeling down earlier. But now? This is just incredible. I feel like I can take on any building challenge. That's the spirit. And remember, if you ever get stuck, just give me a shout. Helping out friends is what makes all of this fun. Plus, seeing you smile and enjoying the build, priceless. I don't know how to thank you. This day has been such a roller coaster. All right, let's get this mini mansion started. Oh, wow, JJ, that's a bold design you're going for there. Thanks, Mikey. I've always wanted to try this out. When you're tiny, everything seems so much grander. Look at this. I'm putting in a mini balcony. Whoa, that's fancy. I'm just trying to get my roof straight. It's harder when you're this small. Everything feels so amplified. Oops, looks like I made my doorway a bit too small even for Mini-Me. No way, this is trickier than I thought. Are you kidding me? Your house is looking awesome. Mine looks like a toddler built it. Oh my gosh, why can't I get the hang of this? Hey, hey, don't be so hard on yourself. Everyone's got their own style and you're just finding yours. Besides, it's all about having fun, right? I guess you're right, but wow, your mini mansion is looking incredible. I'm a little jealous. Well, maybe after we're done, I can help you add some finishing touches to yours. Holly Molly, we could even add a tiny bridge connecting our houses. That sounds amazing. Crazy how being this small can bring out such big creativity. Exactly, big or small, it's all about the adventure and the memories we create along the way. So don't sweat it. Let's just have fun with this. <sighs> No way. I can't believe how bad I am at this. Look at that wall. It's all crooked. 
Whoa, Mikey! Don't be so hard on yourself! Every building has its… character. It makes it unique. Unique? More like uniquely terrible! Look at your house. It's practically a work of art. Oh my gosh! Oops! Come on, don't say that. Every masterpiece has its rough drafts. Remember the first time we tried to build a treehouse? It wasn't perfect the first time either. Yeah, but yours was way better than mine even then. I'm starting to think maybe this isn't for me. I kind of envy how easily things come to you. Hey, it's all right. Building is just one of those things I've had a bit more practice with. But guess what? You have so many other amazing talents. And besides, I'm here to help. We're a team. Thanks, JJ. That means a lot. I just wish I could get the hang of this. What was that saying? Rome wasn't built in a day? Well, neither is a mini mansion. Let's work together on this. I promise we'll make something both of us can be proud of. You do that for me, even with your own build going on? Of course. Friends help each other out. And besides, our amazing viewers are always there cheering us on. I bet they'd love to see us collaborate. Wow, you're right. Thanks, JJ. And thanks to all the subscribers out there. Your support means everything. Always, Mikey. Now let's turn this building around. Holly Molly, we've got a mini mansion to complete. Well, Mikey, something's come up. I've got to head out for a bit. Crazy timing, I know. What? Right now? But we were just getting started on the houses. I know, I know. It's super sudden, but trust me, if I could avoid it, I would. This is something I just can't put off. Oh my gosh, is everything okay, JJ? Yeah, everything's all right. It's just some things require immediate attention, you know? But hey, could you keep an eye on my mini house while I'm gone? Whoa, you're leaving it with me? Are you kidding me? After you've seen my building skills? Oops, come on. Whoa, what happened here? Mikey, what did you do? JJ, I, I'm so sorry. No way, Mikey, my house. I asked you to watch it for me. Are you kidding me? Look, JJ, I didn't think it would come to this, but I was so jealous of how beautiful your house was compared to mine. Jealous? Jealous enough to destroy it? Holly Molly, I trusted you, Mikey. I know, and I messed up, big time. Your house was just so perfect. And mine was, well, you saw it. So you decided to level the playing field by tearing mine down? What was that? That's so not cool. I know, I know, it's just, every time I looked at your house, it was a reminder of how bad mine was. It made me feel so inadequate. Mikey, it's just a game. And besides, we're friends. You could have just talked to me instead of wrecking my hard work. You're right, JJ. I let my emotions get the better of me. I just felt so overshadowed by your talent. But that was no reason to destroy your house. I'm really, truly sorry. This isn't just about a game or houses, Mikey. It's about trust, respect, and our friendship. I never thought you'd do something like this. I never thought so either, JJ. I made a huge mistake, and I regret it. All I can do now is apologize and try to make things right. If you let me, I want to help rebuild your house, even better than before. I appreciate that, but it's going to take time to rebuild the trust we had. I just, I need some time to think. I understand, JJ. Just know that I'm truly sorry. I hope we can move past this and be friends again. Whoa, JJ, what's with the TNT? Are you out of your mind? You pushed me to this, Mikey. You wanted to be alone? Let's see how you feel when everything you've built is in ruins. Oh my gosh, JJ, this isn't you. Don't let anger cloud your judgment. This isn't how friends deal with disagreements. Friends? You threw that word out the window when you decided to toss me aside. I was just trying to find myself, JJ. But blowing up my home, this is extreme. Well, maybe next time you'll think twice before betraying someone who cared for you. This isn't about betrayal. This is about you trying to control and manipulate the situation. You can't just blow up someone's house because you're mad. Oh, I can. And I will. You started this, Mikey. No way, JJ. Look, I'm sorry I hurt you. I really am. But this, this is too much. We can talk this out. Find Why a solution. I? Give me one good reason not to light it up right now. Oh, JJ, look at this mess. I can't believe it came to this. Yeah, it's crazy how emotions can cloud our judgment, huh? I'm so sorry, JJ. I shouldn't have pushed you away like that. It was wrong of me. And I shouldn't have tried to blow up your home. I let my anger and hurt feelings take control. That wasn't cool of me. Whoa, you think? But seeing all of this, it's just bricks and wood. We can rebuild. What I regret most is how I made you feel. 
Dear friends, if you enjoyed today's wild adventure, please hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe for more fun with Mikey and me. All right, catch you in the next one. Peace out.